Hey guys, so it's Liz. So right now it is 9.52. I'm recording this actually rather late because time did escape from me. Um, I do have this in front of my face because I'm about to go in. Like I said, time did escape from me. Hopefully I can make the vlog today a little bit longer. I didn't realize that this is causing poof balls in more spots than I thought. Um... But yeah, time escaped for me. I got off a little earlier than, or I left home a little later than I thought. Uh, excuse me. I went to Wawa, got myself a pep or Coke. I almost said Pepsi. My husband drinks Pepsi. Um, I can drink Pepsi and Coke, but I prefer Coke. Um, but like I said, I can drink both. Um, but. Um, other than that, like, really nothing is going to be going on. Uh, yesterday I did start a vlog, but I ended up deleting it because it was a rather emotional day. What are you doing? Like, how are you going to pull up from a parking spot over there and then just try to go to another parking spot? Oh, you're going to keep going. Okay. Sorry, going into another parking spot. I'm like, you just came out of one. But, um... But yeah, yesterday was in a rather emotional day. Um, he went back to the doctors because he wasn't feeling great or his shoulder wasn't feeling great still. So now he has to go see a specialist, but it's all covered under workman's comp. But um, we tried calling the specialist and apparently um, the workman comp agent has to call the specialist to make the appointment. Now, we weren't told that yesterday. We were just told that we had to call a specialist. Um, apparently, the workman comp agent has to call a specialist, arrange the appointment, and then we just have to figure out when the appointment was arranged for and go from there. Um, I w secretly, I was hoping it was going to be for today so I could be able to call out and we'd be able to go today. Um, but... But yeah, we'll just have to wait and see. We, he did call our um, HR lady um, that works. Obviously, she's the HR of our job. He called her. She said that she would call them and get it all set up and let him know by later on. Um, she might let me know and then I'll let him know later on tonight when I go home or on break, whatever. Um, but we'll just have to wait and see. Hopefully you guys can hear me perfectly fine. I keep having to move this down because it does get in the way of my mouth. Um, and I am wearing the headphones outside of that, um, to try to hopefully see if you guys can hear me better. Um, I know that my voice does get muffled the more I talk because this covers it. So, um, yeah, I will step back on here a little bit later. Like I said, um, I have to go into work. Um, do I want to? No. Um, it, because yesterday was emotional. I wasn't, I, I wasn't exactly thrilled because they have a policy at the doctor that we went to last week for the original appointment. I was not allowed to be in there with him. Um, I had to sit in the car. Um, so I was actually rather upset um, I thought it was stupid that, you know, Wednesday I was able to go in and stand with him during his appointment after mine was over. Um, even, you know, I was, I sat down after my appointment in the waiting room and, sh and the receptionist says, oh, you can go see your husband in, in the, the doctor's office. So I went and I stood with my husband and the doctor didn't care. Um, but then when we went in yesterday, the receptionist said that I was not allowed to be in the waiting room. It's, com it's policy. So I thought it was kind of weird because, you know, the lady, the receptionist, the first time she just said that, you know, well, can you wait in the car until your husband is done? Um, or wait outside until your husband's done? No, she let me go in the back and see him. So, um, sorry, I have something in my eye. So I just, I thought it was weird and I would just, I was not having it and he's like, oh, you just didn't like the fact that they sent you out, they, that they sent you away. Um, and probably, but for the simple fact that 
if it was a policy, it should have happened the first time after my visit instead of having it the second time when I didn't have a visit as well. So it is what it is, I guess, right? All right. So right now it is, um, I think, 116 and taking my first break. Um, it's been one of those days where I'm just, I'm ready to go home. I'm glad a fucking slob parked next to me. Um, you can make some of the yard. Sorry, but that's quite disgusting when you walk up to your car and you find that there's a whole bunch of eggs. Hard boiled eggs. of your car door. That's truly disgusting. Stop going down. Um, yeah, like I said, taking my first break. Um, lately I've been taking it late because of the medication. Because of the medication, um, I've been taking it later so that way I can base it off of the time I have to take my medication, or so that way I can base it off of that. Um, so I have to stretch my back. I'm hurt. I'm, not, I'm sore. I didn't hurt myself. I'm just sore. And especially with it being just a bad day in general, between breaking down, crying, and um, just being overall stressed. I think it's just taking its toll on me. Um, I don't handle stress very well. Um, even though my husband tells me I have to learn how to handle it better, I still don't. Um, so between being just emotionally and mentally just done with everything today, I'm just blah, just very blah today. All right, so right now it is 527. I had to do a minor shop. So now that I'm done with my shop, I get to go home. Um, yes, I know I should be driving with both hands, but I'm still in the parking lot. Um, don't get mad. Um, I, I just wanna do this vlog, for this outro for the vlog because um, I won't be doing a vlog for the next couple days because it's my day off. Um, and I won't really be able to because he's not gonna be sleeping. He's gonna be awake. Um, especially since we have to do houses. Sorry, I'm trying to use both my hands to drive. Um, yeah, like I said, He's not working, and we're looking at houses tomorrow. Um, he he does still have a job, mind you, but uh, he did hurt himself a couple of days ago, so he is unable to work at the moment um, until we get that sorted out. God, it's hot. Um, but we'll get that sorted out soon. We get to see a specialist. One of these days, hopefully. And yeah, and we're gonna get a green. Cool. So, other than that, nothing's really going on. Um, I have two days off, which is great. Um, and yes, I do feel better only because I'm going home. I, I so badly wanna go home and just go home. Um, and I think that's like, anything anybody wants at the end of a, of a long, long day is just to go home because it's just been one of those stressful days. Um, I am mentally and emotionally just exhausted. Um, it's just been one of those days where you're mentally, emotionally exhausted, you're physically tired, 
Um, your, your body's just hurting. Um, it's just one of those days where you're just excited to go home. Um, and it's, 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 yeah. Um, I can't wait to go home, see my husband kick off my shoes. Because, oh my god, I want to get my feet out of these shoes. Um, but yeah. Other than that, nothing really ex too exciting is going to be happening today. Going to play some games, probably read, uh, finish the rest of my book, start a new one, and yeah, so hopefully you guys enjoyed the vlog for today. If you did, please like, subscribe, share with your friends and family, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys!